What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Ari. Welcome back to AM Line of Vibes. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing great. Can't complain. Today I'm here with another reaction video. I'm gonna be reacting to Snoop Dogg Double OG Uncle Uncle Snoop Snoop Lion D, D Double OG. Look, wait, wait. It's D O Double G Snoop Doggy Dog in the building versus Uncle Ruckus, the meanest, nastiest, racist. Oh damn. A white slash black guy there is. It's an animated interview. That's what I'm saying. If you guys are new to the channel, smash the like button, subscribe, comment all that good stuff down below in the comment section. Anything you want to read, want to see me react to, just let me know in the comment section down below. I'll be on it like I can't say white on rice again. On, on flies on shit. Oh well, I already said it. With that being said, let's get into the video. Let's react to the video. Oh, R.I.P. to John Witherspoon. Pops. R.I.P. sir. Did a good job. Made me laugh a lot of times. You don't need to watch his Breakfast Club interview. He talk about a lot of shit. I didn't even know they did that. Slamming the ball in the net. A white man would go out. He'd go out about 10 yards. He would survey up the situation. He would use mathematics. He would use geometry to figure out the arc of the ball to go into the goal. Now they have a ha! Ha! A goddamn eight swinging out of a net. Uncle Ruckus. I didn't even call you Uncle Ruckus. Ruckus. Such a lame ass up, man. <laughs> so you saying that the white man invented all of these sports? Yeah. Now they just start letting them play them. That's why they still have numbers on their back, so they do. Oh, that's my number. It's been on the play too. I gotta keep track of him. Now my eight on that, so they can not let get lost. I will say one sport that white folks is dominant in hockey is swimming. Oh, that's right, that's correct. They can swim. Because once again, I said that they don't have heavy bottom. White folks have really light bottoms. Oh, I'm going to drown! Am I <laughs> You cannot drown a white man even if you try. White men will naturally float to the Who's the great white open man? Well, basketball ain't good no more since somebody like Buddy is gone. Bird. Now, when them people gone, basketball just ain't, it ain't enjoyable no more. I ain't watched basketball since Pistol Pete. Wait, man, I realize something. All the other Caribbean countries, right? Why are we never going to the Olympics and, and dominate swimming? Because it can't be that really, I want to say white people, nobody's better than us. You know, we, we black people are amazing. I'm not saying white people aren't, but. We just, we, we just, it's just something about us. They can hate on us, don't get me wrong, but we're, we're pretty freaking dope. I thought to say after my didn't want cuss. I'm trying to stop cussing that much. But we're pretty freaking good. But yeah, people from the Caribbean, like Jamaica, Bahamas, Turks and Caicos, uh, British, British Virgin Islands, how come we never go into the limits and dominate? Will we have all this damn water? We have the actual, come on, man, we gotta do better. Now I think about it, we gotta do better. I can ask them. Wow. That was a long time ago. Oh, that basketball was good. When they woke, when they woke sensible size shots like mid thigh. Mm -hmm. They wore them high socks that came up to the knees. Mm -hmm. And they very gently bounced the ball down the floor. <laughs> there wasn't no slamming the ball in the net. A white man would go out. He'd go out about 10 yards. He would survey up the situation. He would use mathematics. He would use geometry. To figure out the arc of the ball to go into the goal. Now they have a Goddamn eight swinging out of a net. Keep asking now. The white man did give us Black History Month. Yes, he did. And that was mighty generous of you. That yeah. was mighty white of you to give us Black History Month. 28 days. 28 days. 28 days more than your black ass I'm gonna have. 28 days of every day of that week. You agree with me on this, don't you? Yes, right. Every day of them 28 days, the black man should have his black ashy ass knee down on the ground, praying and thanking the white man for giving me them 28 days. 
Mm -hmm. you know, what y'all do with it this day? What they do with it this day? Mm -hmm. It's Black History Month. Let's barbecue and rob. Break <laughs> yourself! Y'all need to be out there thanking the white man for giving you that. He didn't have to give you that. Hell, I think he ought to have a month where he just takes everything away he done gave the black man, don't you? Wreck this shit Let's go! God damn it, let's go! Oh, man. Facts. Take it right away from him. What month? It don't matter. Whatever month he chooses. He's going to keep you confused. It might be January. It might be March. Hell, it might be February when you think it's Black History Month. Let's take back months. <laughs> Yo, your right to vote? Give me your right to vote. You don't need that. You can use it right now. Barack Obama. Oh, your president. <laughs> yeah, the niggas did, the niggas did elect themselves a president. I guess we may as well let y'all have a few years just to see how much y'all have to say. Let's give them a half black man in the office. Hmm. So I enjoy the white side of him. You do? But the other side of him is just dumb as a bucket of donkey. <laughs> So what side of him is white? He gets that from his mother or his father? Well, the way that he can speak, I like that. That's from his white mother. <laughs> and then all the stupid ass laws he's making, that's from his mother. <laughs> and have opinions about uh, what they think they would do. Present a specific plan. Uh -huh. This is the greatest talk you, show. Were you trained? Were you trained? Were you trained by the white man? I'm so cool. I was. Cause they, somebody brought a book up here today uh, called "How to Be a Black Man" or something. How to be a black man? Mm -hmm. Do they really need training in that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how much training do it take to be a black man? You go, what, 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 what was in there? The races to Roscoe. What was in there? I don't. I mean, what was? What was in that book? Don't use a napkin. <laughs> what was in the book? <laughs> Hell, I could have wrote that. That's two pages. Fifteen dollars. Everyone, we have an announcement to make. Here comes a new challenger. Okay, that's the end of the video. You know what's crazy? I know. A lot of white people, I know a lot of white race, okay, let me say that. A lot of racist white people actually feel, this is for all, this is all for fun and jokes and game, right? But they feel this way about us, you know. Some of them, some, I don't say all, I say some. Some of them really feel this way about us. Say stupid, <laughs> say stupid swinging monkeys. Oh my gosh, they really feel about that about us guys, but that's okay, it doesn't matter, it's our time, we're taking back, not even just one country, we're taking back the world, one step at a time, we're gonna make this work, we're gonna move forward, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you guys laugh at least one time, or if you find it interesting, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below, we're on the road to 100k, you guys might be saying, why you never say on the road to 1000, I don't want 1000, I want 100k, I want that plaque, so therefore, I'm gonna get me my plaque, so help you boy, get to 100k, come on man, I wrote to 100k, with that being said, smash the like button, subscribe, comment, turn on post notifications, every time I upload you guys will so know, okay, you guys will know, oh, no, I was choking, I, I, I need some tea, I'm, my next, I'm gonna boil me some tea and I'm gonna drink that, that's what I need, because I keep on helping belch, I keep on belching gas, but anyway, let me leave my personal problems, my, my gassy ass to the side, <laughs> gassy ass. But with that being said, remember, until we meet again, the world is yours. Peace, I'm out.